Hey guys, what's up? It is your girl, Cinquanta Cox Smith of www.cinquantacoxsmith.com. Smile for me. So today I am here with a video in the business idea series. So today we're going to be talking about um, starting a mug business and why this is so um, good or an easy business to start because you will only deal with one type of product. So within that mug business, you can decide if you want it to be um, just one style, one type, one niche, or you can have a niche and then have sub niches inside of that brand. I am going to show you guys a clip of some of the mugs that I have um, for my business, Coins and Connections. So I'm going to show you a few of those. I love um, the white and black mugs. I don't like the 11 ounce, so I normally just sell 8 ounce uh, mugs. I also know that a lot of the websites um, in print on demand do have like the camp mugs now. Um, I am going to show you three websites that I enjoy using for mugs, um, and they both have well, all three of them have different varieties. And then I'm also going to talk a little bit about how you can start your mug business at home by, you know, pressing your own mugs and stuff like that. So let's go ahead and get into it. And the all right. So I have three mugs here. Adults and requires coins and um, Black Charlotte. And your goal is simple. Fuck shit up. So the black mug is tea launch. And also as the other black mugs that you see in this video is from tea launch. And all of the white ones are from the first website we're going to talk about is tea launch. So I normally use tea launch just for my black mugs. Okay. So that is just my preference. There's nothing wrong with their white mugs or different mugs. I just truly enjoy getting my black mugs from Tea Launch. I've never had an issue and they, they don't cost that much, right? So they do have the accent mug. They have the black mug. They have the magic mug, which uh, change colors with the temperature. Um, they have, you know, the basic white mugs and they have the vacuum tumblers, which I do have a, one of the actual tumblers, but it's not a mug. So that was no need for me to show that. And then there's the 15 ounce. Oh, maybe it's the 15 ounce that I don't like. Maybe it's the 11 ounce mugs that I got, but this is just, you know, then they have this bear steen. Um, again, something else that you can use. I didn't, did I section this by, um, I should have did it by glassware, go back inside. But remember, um, on T launch, you have to have a Shopify account. Um, you don't have to use the account. You can set it up and use the $9 store on pause, but in order to use T launch, you have to have a Shopify uh, storefront. And that's not just to sell, but here are a few other mugs here, personalized mugs. So they have lots of different varieties with T launch, okay? So then we're going to look at Printed Make. Printed Make also has some good varieties. Here they have that camp mug that I was talking about, um, a deluxe mug, which is 15 ounces. Um, they have the black and white mug. They have a glass mug. Um, they have the pink handle mug in both sizes, a red handle. They have the latte mug. See, the, another beer scene. And they have stainless steel. They have gold. They have frosted. And then they have pink. Let's see if there's any more on the second page. Um, there's a travel mug with lid and there's a silver mug. So they have lots of variety as well. Um, I know I talked to you guys already about setting up a printed main account, but in order to set up with Etsy, it's just a quick step that you have to do, do and email them to get your store connected. <clears throat> and then the last one I want to talk about is Printful. Of course, I use Printful mainly for their just white glossy mugs. They do have this enamel camp mug they have the mug with the ceramic color inside blue red yellow and then they also have the magic mugs in glossy and in matte black um i do want to quickly i want to go over to zazzle because zazzle does have mugs as well um that could be of help to someone let's see over here
Would it be an office in school? No. Home. Home. Kitchen. Move thing. <laughs> so I'm going to home, kitchen, mugs and cups. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys that they do have mugs as well. See, they have the ones with the color handles, ceramic on the outside. Um, they do have the latte mugs and espresso mugs. They have a travel mug, jumbo, mug sets, beer mugs. I love this little thing right here. But they do have um, some options for different mugs as well. So the last option is to um, do sublimation. And if you have a sublimation machine or a lot of people change their Epsons into sublimation machines, you can get you a mug press from Amazon or wherever you like to buy your equipment from. But they have lots of mug presses. And if you already do like heat press and stuff, you can actually buy a heat press machine with a mug press. Um, and the other way that you can create mugs at home by using vinyl, it's the permanent adhesive vinyl that you would need um, a cutter to use to make it easier. But you could cut it by hand if you were good with an, an uh, exacto knife or something like that. But you could create um, mugs like that uh, for your business. So I am going to go over on Etsy. So I like to do these, you know, live search of things so you guys understand that I'm not the only one. And look, on the home screen, I always tell you, Etsy is in it. So the first thing I see is like a mug. So look at that style. That's that style. We've been looking at those camp mugs. So this business looks like they do a custom personalized portrait mug. Um here so that looks really interesting i want to know if they oh, sorry y'all uh, i want to know if they draw it i wonder if it's hand drawn so it says enter the names of the portraits enter custom text for back of mug send me photos via instagram to see less oh okay so looks like this might be a little hand drawn so these are the different mugs that they have which is, this is a really great idea for something, somebody who's super creative. They can put a message on the back. Okay. So these are like pictures of different people. See, that's nice. And, and this tells me they use printed mink, right? Because I know how printed mink ships. So that tells me that they use printed mink. So here's a picture. So she does draw. So that is dope. So we're going to look for, y'all know I like sloth. So let's look for sloth mugs. Um, okay, so this one is a personalized mug that says sloth for um, Samantha. This one is a whole sloth gift box. Sloths have Sophia on it with the sloth on the top. So I wanna, okay, so Wembley mugs. Let's see, this looks like a business who does mugs. Look at how many sales they have, 23,000. So we're going to check out Wembley mugs. Oh, I thought I clicked it, sorry y'all. <laughs> um, every item has a story and we want to hear yours. So they definitely customize in mugs. They have 361. They have them separated into dog, gifts to men, wedding, animals, constellation. Um, they look like they do have some wine tumblers here as well. So this is a mug business. And this is what they basically, this is what they do, right? So let's see. Let's sort by bestseller. Let's see. Um relevant so i was looking for the best seller but it doesn't do that oh let's see what custom is i don't know but most of these are personalized as well um i can't i'm sure they probably use a print on demand site um especially because all the mock-ups are pretty much the same as well and i i'm just assuming
Um, but this is what I mean when I say focus on <laughs> one thing. So these are some good pictures here. Probably took that at home. But this is really nice to let you know, you know, exactly what you're getting. And again, they had 23,000 sales and almost five star reviews. And I'm sure shipping probably pays um, a fact in some reviews. Okay. That's just how that works. But right here, I'm looking at five star, five star, five star. So mug business is a good idea if you do some good research. Um, I know for a fact, a lot of personalized things sell a lot. I sell a lot of personalized things on one of my Etsy shops and it is one of my best sellers. So if you can come up with a niche in some way, make it personalized experience for the customers um, and you can charge a little bit more because it's personalized and find the right print on demand site that you want to use. I think you can do great when having a mug business. So I hope you guys enjoyed this visit, um, this video in the business idea series. Let me know down below. Do you collect mugs? Do you like mugs? Um, do you have mugs in your business? Are you a coffee or tea drinker? Make sure you check out all of my courses and tutorials at gumroad.com backslash and quantum Doc smith and until next time i love you more than i love this video peace